Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, so today I'm bringing you the Samsung Muse. The Muse that, you know, I don't know, inspired the Pebble, which it was named, but now it's the Muse! Alright, but yeah, so it's a Muse, is an MP3 player, it has 4 gigs of storage, it has a sound alive built into it, and it has a QR scanner that uh, you can scan uh, for you to get the app for Android phones. So, uh, it's mainly uh, made to be used with the S3 or the Note 2, but I'll explain uh, that why. Why is that? So, if we turn this to the side, we have um, a quick preview of that. Um, this device is similar, of course, to um, Apple's Shuffle, and uh, the really highlight about it is that not only can you connect it to a computer to get music, but with the built-in app, you can actually get music from your Galaxy uh, device. So you can get it from your S3 or Note 2. Or I believe it should work with technically any phone that has the USB. We will do that after the unboxing um, and check that out. But, so you can sync music directly from your phone, uh, no PC required, so that's pretty nice. On the back area, we can see easy music transfer with the Android app. It does have the Sound Live optimized audio. You do have a Galaxy style, of course, it's very reminiscent of the Galaxy S3 uh, Pebble Blue. Um, and it comes in either blue or white. I got the blue one because I have a blue phone. Um, you do have uh, easy to use, you know, on off switch. You have the play, up down arrow, and po uh, plus and minus volume. And all the stuff that's in the box the phone connector, the stereo headphones, uh, PC connector and the uh, Muse itself, along with the Quick Guide. And those are all the different uh, files that can play. And the only really requirement is you have um, Android 3.0 and newer, which pretty much everything has nowadays. Um, and as well, of course, you have uh, Windows uh, uh, Vista or higher, which if you're on still on Vista, I pray for you. Um, so yeah. Actually, if you're on Windows 8, I also pray for you. But anyway, let's see. Take this out. Very clean looking kind of casing we have here. And let's see if I can just pull this out. And nope, it's not letting go. Uh, let's try to open this up from here. That is the Muse. Uh, very simplistic looking. Let's see if we can zoom in and show you guys some of this. So, we have an on button right here. And if you, it does have three parts. So on, then the audio live, and then off. Oh, I was trying to find some music. Um, so yes, you have the play button, pause. On this side right here, we have the hold and shuffle or repeat all. And there's the headphone jack. I'm guessing it's under here. No, where's that connector? Or does, oh, it's uh, just connects through the headphone, I believe. All right, well, let's open this up. And see everything else. Oh, we can kind of zoom out now. All right. So, we have a quick start guide, just probably telling you how to connect it, use it, sync it up, and all that fun stuff. Then your standard limited warranty, and then a bag. For this bag has stuff in it. All right, so we have the headphone to female USB, which, or no, just a regular USB. So this you can use, of course, to connect it to the computer. You just plug it in 
to your device as such. And then just plug it into your computer and then download songs. Or you can, if I can open this up, connect your Muse from the headphone port. You know, these bags are very difficult. Just saying. I think this one got stuck. Oh, I say rip the bag. Okay, we're just going to rip the bag then. This one can go from the headphone port right here into the phone itself. And of course, we'll have a video on that later. And here are the headphones. Now I have been told, yeah, uh, I've been told they're very, uh, what was I called, the ear, ear pod style. So, uh, designed for the ear, you know. Uh, going along with Samsung's Nature UI, of course. Uh, yeah, uh, pretty nice looking uh, headphones. And do they have a mic though? It doesn't look like they have a mic. Which I would be just surprised, although unless the mic is built into it. I will find out if they have a mic or not. It might be within the headphone itself, but I'm not sure. So I will find out if they have a mic or if they're just regular headphones. And you can just plug them in as so and listen to your music. Alright guys, so that was the Muse. Let's take that sticker off just so you can see. Shiny. Um, so yeah, that was the Muse. Uh, we will test it out, show you the software, how to connect it to your computer, as well as to your phone. If you have any questions about the Muse, feel free to ask. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy.